Today we're going to sew a very simple cat dress so that your kitty cat can be straight out of a Beatrix Potter storybook. Here is what you need. A sewing machine or your own two hands, an iron, pins, fabric scissors and pinking shears, a measuring tape, fabric, elastic, a safety pin and your pattern and pencil. And a cat. Meow. Now let's draft the pattern. We'll use printing paper, tape, a ruler, pen and scissors. For the top we'll use two pieces of paper and for the skirt we'll use three pieces. You'll also want to measure your cat around the neck, from nape to chest, around to their chest, then from the chest to the base of the spine. Here is a little look at my pattern. I've highlighted the measurements in relation to the shape of the pattern and I really hope this helps in making your own. Voila, we have our pattern. Now let's trace the pieces and cut them out and sew them together. You'll need two pieces for the top. Once you've traced and cut out both pieces, place them together front side touching. And then trim off any scraggly pieces so that they're both the same size. Now that the top part is matchy matchy in size, we'll pin it together ready for sewing. But first, let's cut out our skirt. Now let's get stitching. Sew all around the edges of the top piece, but make sure you leave an opening at the bottom so that you can use this to turn the fabric the right side out. I've placed a pink pin where you should leave your opening. Snip off any of the loose threads as you go. Cut off any excess overhang with the pinking shears and then turn your fabric the right side out. And now we're going to take a pin or a needle and gently pull out the corners. Press the fabric flat with your iron. Stitch the opening at the bottom either by machine or hand and the top of your dress is complete. Now for the skirt we're going to double fold and pin to hem the sides and the bottom. Once that's done we're going to iron it and then we're going to pin some pleats. Straighten the fabric and then sew it so that the pleats are further. Da, the skirt is done. Now let's attach the two pieces. Now we're going to make a small belt to cover the stitching from where we attach the skirt to the top. Cut out a rectangular piece of fabric and then fold it in half and sew it and then flip it the right way using a safety pin. Flatten it with the iron and fold in the end and then we're going to sew it to the dress. Now all that is left is to attach your elastic or velcro if that's what you prefer and your dress is complete. Congratulations, you've sewn a cat dress. Please remember that it is so important to supervise your cat while they're wearing clothes. Thanks for watching, I hope this was helpful to you and if you sew your cat a dress please show me, I'd love to see. Bye for meow. <laughs>